Welcome to Princess of Tavern. The fun little game where you play as a waitress in an ancient kim kingdom trying to get to the ball. I believe this is somewhere around episode 13, 12, 13, 14, somewhere around there. I like the cute octopus at the bottom. And I don't remember when I went back and made sure I completed all the scenarios to get three stars on them, but I did. It might have been between the last episode and this one. It might have been be before the last episode. I honestly don't remember. But I have currently reached this scenario and the ball is over there, so I've got a very little way to go. And I have gone out and I apparently bought a load of food so I don't have to keep buying food so I can enter the scenarios because it costs you a certain amount of food to enter each scenario. I think I've got all the current upgrades that I can have. It's been a few days since I last looked at this game, so... Yeah, uh, my next uh, upgrade up unlocks 123 stars. So if I get three stars in this scenario, it should unlock another upgrade. Or potential upgrade that I can buy. So, let's head into my wonderful tavern. I've got all the food I need. I have a musician. My waste disposal, me, and now I just need customers. She was going to order sometime today. So far, so good. Then he does that. Little toad. I don't like it when customers go and make a mess of my tables. I find it unacceptable. Great, another one. Just decided to make a mess of my table. Might we're back under control. Click on the actual food I'm trying to pick up. People are eating fast today. Maybe it'll help me get more customers through. Throughput is the the desire and business of every restaurant. The faster they can get people in and out, the more money they can make. thing in the world, I must admit. Let's sit over there. So far, I've still got it under control. I'm sure it'll get messy shortly, because it always does with me. I will accept that things are going well for once. Say it won't last. Let's have some music, shall we? I just managed to spill stuff all over my table. Mm -hmm. 
waiting for your food. Come on. Don't miss click now. As I've used my music used my uh, musician, which helps keep people happy. On the plus side, looks like I shouldn't have too big a problem actually getting to my goal. People are still coming in on mass, which I find a little bit less than optimal. And they're still making demands of me, which again I'm finding a little bit less than optimal. Oh, I need to do that. Let's do that. As you can see, I'm running backwards and forwards like a maniac here, but I. I made the three stars, I got the reach the target, and these are my last two customers, so hopefully they'll leave fast. So 26 customers earned 1,382 gold coins and got the three stars. And your upgrade is available in the shop. That's not unexpected, as previously discussed. The upgrade will make your customers quite generous. In that case, we'll buy it. And on to the next one. This got quite costly in corn to enter this scenario. And this is where I... I don't dislike this game, because the game itself is quite enjoyable to play. But most games of this ilk when you play them, they have some variety. They add more complexity each time, or they add a new product, or they add they add something. This game doesn't. So it feels like you're doing the same thing over and over. With no variety. Which is not great. It's something that, if this was a new game, I would be quite happy asking them to change, but they're not going to change this game now because it's an old game. But I would prefer it if there was something, some more variety in this game. It's, this, this game's pretty much its one lacking feature is a lack of variety. Most games of this type, whether it be, oh, sorry, wrong way, Game House Studios games or other games I've played, like My Farm Life. Uh, each time you complete one, one level, they change. Oops, oh, I've got to think about. They change what you have to do, so it's slightly more complex next time around. Again, not necessarily good or bad, it's just is. But this one doesn't. Which is not always ideal. At least in my opinion. So whilst I enjoy getting to the new mini games, etc., I wish I didn't have to do the same thing five times before I got there.
you. Oh, it is you. Okay. I thought I might have been delivering that to the wrong person for a second then. Oh, these rich people demanding peanuts. Not making me happy. because their table's a mess. Another three stars. Another 26 customers. This time I only got 1,201. I think last time was, was it 31382? So a little less gold. Well, I've got time to complete a third scenario. I say that's why I bought all this food so I didn't have to keep going back to the shop and buying the food I needed at the beginning of each scenario. But equally. Oh, I've got five tables now. Oh, a difference. Not that I've ever filled up four tables, but I've now got five tables to deal with. This could mean I'm about to have more customers. under control for the moment. Won't last much longer, that much I do know. Oh, I clicked in the wrong place there. But yeah, I've got five tables, I'm only currently using two of them. is not necessarily the most efficient restaurant in the world. I'm trying to match the right people at the right tables. I haven't even reached one star yet. I'm getting the feeling this could be a rather longer scenario. does help if I click on the right place as well. I don't know why I went there. places. Not great, I mean that's the whole idea of the game. Yeah, went from having 
no stars to almost having two at this point. And I'm having trouble clicking again. Now maybe it's me. In fact, let's face it, it probably is me making mistakes. But maybe there's something quirky with the game. Unlikely, I know. But that's just a potential excuse for me. Let's have some music. bit of music by the wonderful musician standing by the waste disposal. Strange place for a musician to stand, I suppose, but who am I to say what a musician should and shouldn't do? It's been a long time since I considered myself a musician. easily make more than enough I need for the three stars. Oh, you cannot demand a bowl of peanuts. Being the last customer in the restaurant and have finished a meal, she demands a bowl of peanuts. Bar humbug. I served 28 customers this time. It's gone up just slightly. I earned 1,330. Still not as good as I did in the first scenario in this episode. And I wish I had time to do this this one here, but I don't because doing that one would unlock to see what I've got to get to to the next get to the next mini game. But that was three quick scenarios done. Oh, it's this one, level 44. I'm guessing there's probably going to be about 50 levels. But I guess I'll find that out shortly. I'm going to end this episode here. I hope you enjoyed, or at least didn't find it boring. And if you did, well, there's nothing I can do about it now. It's a bit late. And have a fun day, and I'll see you down the road for more of the Princess of Tavern, hopefully. Cheerio!